just want to note that Bo Biden, I believe is 46, the former attorney general for Delaware, I believe it was, right? Delaware. Um, son of Joe Biden, Vice President Joe Biden, passed away, I guess it was Saturday, of he'd been in a long battle with brain cancer since 2013, apparently had gone into remission and then came back over the past couple of months. Uh, two things of note. I mean, it, and generally I don't pay much attention to deaths of, of well-known people. I mean, unless, but Joe Biden, I think everybody knows that story about at, right after he got elected into the Senate in his, uh, Late 20s, I think he was. Maybe, yeah, I think it was like 29, maybe 30. Elected at 29, and I think you can't take a Senate until you're 30, I think. So he was in Washington setting up his staff. He got a phone call. It was uh, mid-December. His family had been in a car accident. His wife and his daughter died in the accident. His two sons, one of whom was Bo, in the hospital. He... It sounded like he almost didn't take his position as senator, but he insisted on being sworn in from their hospital rooms because he didn't want to leave them. You can see a picture of Bo when he was four, looking at his father and getting... Uh, so this is particularly sad for a parent to outlive um, two, at least, of, of his three children. Um, and Bo Biden also, you know, to the extent that I was aware of what he did as a uh, as an attorney general, he was very strong on the whole mortgage thing. Um, one of the big holdouts for the uh, national settlement, and then uh, he he stopped at one point. I don't know if it was in in any way related to his illness, but uh, also very good on you know things like child protection. So um, just wanted to to mention that because uh, a real shame.